guys, welcome back to Ganji Plans. I'm doing a weekly plan with me video this week. Um, and if you caught the preview from earlier this week on my community tab, you will already know that I'm switching things up. Usually, um, when I do my weekly plan with me, so I'll do it like the second week of the month. And so I have a week in whatever weekly setup I'm using before I plan on camera. Um, but that I, I went through a week of this insert two, which is great. It's good for what it is. And it was working really well. And as you see here, I actually didn't need any dailies. I just did my to-do list here on the, um, on the little weekly, uh, part here. You should know, by the way, I put everything on Saturday, but I wasn't planning to do it on Saturday. I never was. This is always stuff for Monday, but Monday's not on the weekly. So anyway, I realized that I really wanted sort of dailies, but I didn't want to like keep printing out dailies. I really was feeling the itch to move to a different inserts, uh, which I have done before here. This is insert 28. If you don't remember this, I haven't used it in a couple months. I'm really proud of this one. Um, it's got like a weekly here. So you've got room for like three projects with next action items, a general to-do list. Um, the habit tracker goes all the way across like this with these little boxes here, go to the habit tracker. And then there's some spaces. You've got your dailies and then watch this Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and you can see the weekly the entire time. That goes well with the idea of the fold out as well. So you can see your weekly fold out, which I'm going to keep up because I feel like I may as well. I already have them printed and I'll see how well that um, sort of all adds together. So this week, this month, I um, kind of just printed out all of the fold outs and I have them all in the front and then I just kind of close it like this. I'll probably close this weekly fold out. There we go. So they're separate, like the last week's inserts are between this week's fold out, but I, it's not been a problem so far, especially with my little bookmark, which I'm taking out for now and hopefully will not forget again. Um, and we're just going to plan in here. So I'm going to start as I usually do with just a little bit of highlighting, um, a little washi tape. I'm not going to do anything too elaborate color wise or like decoration wise. Uh, cause I would like to have room for a nice robust to-do lists because what's happening, obviously Monday is Labor Day. For those of you not in the U S we get Monday the 6th off. Um, so I'm filming this on Sunday. Uh, so I have, as I said, that whole to-do list of errands to run because we're planning my daughter's first birthday party, which is happening not this weekend, but next weekend. So I got to get everything together. Um, and then we also have plans for this next weekend. So let's just jump in. Uh, I'm going to turn on some music, grab your own planner and a cup of coffee or whatever, uh, get comfortable and do something while I'm working on this. And I will see you at uh, the end of it to discuss.
but apologies in advance if you can hear my husband and daughter having a dance party in the other room. Uh, the baby is awake and he is keeping an eye on her, um, letting me do this. So yeah, I don't know. She's shouting. I don't know if you can hear her. All right. So we've got, um, this is the general to-do list for the week. And I think there's only like two things to move over. Ugh, I need to really go through some old passwords. This has been on my list for forever and it's kind of important, but also super boring and time consuming. And, ugh, so I should just do like one. And this, I'm not going to give any more context for. This little dot I'm using to say, this is a next action for a project. So when I'm done with this, I should go and look at the project page and then come back and put the next task on there. Um, that worked okay last week. I did one and then the next. So this is where I'm gonna put my content list for the week. Um, you know, check things off as they get done. Make sure I don't miss anything. I've started posting reels, which is fun, but I haven't found a good way to schedule those. So I have to be on top of like posting them at the right time for now. And then um, this section is usually like the next week section, but it might be the to film section because uh, it has also been that recently. All right, so as you see, Labor Day, I accidentally put picture day on Monday. Good thing it was on a removable sticker and I was able to just move it. So picture day is Tuesday and that means we have to, you know, give our daughter a shower and brush her hair and put her in something cute. <laughs> um, next year, if she's still at the same school, it, she'll have a uniform. But for now, uh, we are in charge of picking her clothes every day. So yeah, tomorrow I have errands to run. Um, this is for three separate, there's, there's room for three separate projects. But really, it's the one big project. Um, and I don't know what habits I'm going to do. I think vitamins, meaning Agnes's vitamins. We ran out of um, vitamin D drops. And she's so close to being one and being able to drink cow's milk. And she also just loves being outside. So I'm not too worried about it. Um, we're not replenishing those. And then we'll... Uh, yeah. That's, that's it. Then there's a blissful year when they're one, when they're not recommended to take any vitamins that I know of. Um, and then at two, she'll start taking the gummies that I just love so much. She's already starting to go, hey, how come I don't get gummies? Because you're only one. Well, not even. So yeah, I have errands to run tomorrow, hopefully with Agnes. I'm hoping her three-year-old um, perspective will help me pick out some really good party favorites. Um, but that's mostly what it is. It's like party stuff. Um, I guess I'll put that here. Party. And then backyard, which is also party related. But it's part of it. Um, I just need to kind of tidy up and get everything cleared out because they're going to, um, we're having somebody put in pavers in our backyard. The area that's all weeds is going to be pavers and gravel. And uh, I'm so excited for this. I can't even tell you. Um, it's just been too long, but it's been an absolute wreck out there and we're getting it done in time for the party. Uh, I just need to like move the compost tumbler out of the way and like get everything sort of tidied up out there a little bit before it gets messy again. And then we will clean it in earnest, uh, next weekend. This weekend I think is when it's all happening. Um, but we're going to be at a company picnic for most of the day. And then my mom's, um, work is having a fundraiser dinner. So I'm going to be going to that. We still have to figure out whether we're spending the night. Um, like we were going to, but I'm thinking maybe we shouldn't because I just kind of don't want to bother with that. It's a lot of work. And then it's just, it's an extra Sunday morning of driving. And so I, I might try to take the train up or something. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway, uh, Thursday, Friday are pretty normal. I pay the babysitter on Thursdays. So I always put that as like my first task of the week. Um, yeah, I really don't have anything to put on Tuesday and Wednesday. I will probably assign one of these. Um, I can do that now for Tuesday right now. Um, let's see. One of these will be for morning because I get up early to do stuff like this. Content stuff. This is when I get most of my, um, insert designing done and stuff like that in early, early morning before everybody gets up. Eh. 
that's why I have these stickers from Mad Hatter Sticker Co. By the way, um, this one's from Planner Kate. This one's from 2016. These headers are from Mad Hatter. And then I think that's it. Um, this washi and this washi are from Simply Gilded. So there you go. And then the other box will be dinner. At some point, we need to get some groceries done. It's like an extra headache because we have been loyal customers of Walmart grocery pickup for years, like before the pandemic. And then when the pandemic hit, it was even easier. Um, just, I love not having to worry about taking the kids out of their car seats and all of that. The problem is now we're trying to get into the habit of using script for school. And for whatever reason, you can't use a Walmart gift card for Walmart grocery pickup. It makes no sense. I know you're thinking like, what? That doesn't make, it doesn't, it doesn't make any sense at all. But the point is now I have to get out of my car and I braved a trip to Walmart, like the big Walmart and it was under construction, which I didn't realize. And it was, oh my gosh, it was, it was a thing. I still haven't checked if the ice cream melted all the way while we were trying to get through checkout. Um, anyway, at some point, either Sunday, Monday or Tuesday, we're going to have to do groceries. The good news is that my three-year-old is in love with the concept of riding in a cart and going and helping me do my grocery shopping. So that's something, at least her enthusiasm. Someone is having a good time. Um, so that's it. So I've got my little dailies here, like space for specific dailies, but like not a full page. I um, realized when I used the two days per page dailies, um, undated dailies, I think it's insert 46, um, that, that was enough space for me. That was pretty good. It was pretty basic. And so I'm like, okay, two days per page. That's the same as this. And that way I still have a little weekly here and there's space for it. It's all set up. I don't have to worry about how many dailies I have printed out. So that's why I'm switching to this and I think it's going to work. Um, you will get to see a photo of it farther later into the week. I will see if I can make a point of making it a later photo as opposed to just setup photo that you get most uh, weeks. But anyway, that's on Instagram. I always make sure to post a weekly spread on my Instagram. Um, like I said, I'm also trying to do some reels. So, you know, like those because that helps me spread and reach more people and uh, all of that. So that's a big help. And then, yeah, let me know below. Are you, uh, do you, do you, if you plan weeklies, do you stick with the same weekly spread every week? Uh, every week, every month, or are you feeling antsy with the change of the weather or something, something in the air um, wants me to, to switch to a different layout. So here we are. Uh, let me know your thoughts below and I will see you guys in the next video on Thursday. So don't forget to subscribe. Bye.